I love the Amish, but I think they voted in the 2020 election also. Yes, they did, but in 2020, there was only between about 45,000 and 50,000 Amish that were willing to be registered to vote, got their IDs, got a social security number, all of that kind of stuff. Now there's a big change in 2024. That's why I did the previous video. There were a more than 180,000. Now we're approaching, by next week, it'll be more than 200,000 Amish that are registered to vote and are going to vote. And there's two groups that I'm working with that are actually helping the Amish get registered. It's sometimes hard to get some of these very legalistic strict groups to get an ID because they don't want to take their picture. But the Amish themselves, the liberal New Order Amish, are recruiting other groups to try to get registered to vote because when we asked them why, they said their toes were stepped on. Their freedoms were stepped on under the four years the last four years because of those organic farms that were shut down. There were multiple farms shut down for that. The only one that went viral was the Amos Miller case in Pennsylvania. You can Google that. You can find it online. Matter of fact, I think there's still some court dates in the near future that he has to go through. But after that, when you violate their rights, they're going to come roaring. Uh, they not, may not have an Amish mafia like the Amish mafia show. I know that was all fake and staged, but they come with pitchforks. You know what kind of pitchfork it is? Their vote.